The Infinity Drain FCB channel option allows for the use of double waterproofing installations. This video shows the installation of the FCB channel with the SA65 grade. The installation of all 65 and 125 grade styles follow the same procedure. Details of the installation with the 25 grade styles are also shown. The components shown are the contents of the FCB channel with the SA65 grade. Determine the center location of the drain outlet and cut a hole in the subfloor. Typically, linear drain should span from wall to wall. Create a pre-sloped layer for the shower pan. Install drain body into the floor and attach to the existing waistline. Spread a primary mortar bed across the shower area. Slope this layer in all directions toward the drain body at a quarter inch per foot. After the mortar layer is dry, apply adhesive and spread waterproofing membrane as per manufacturer's instructions and local code. Reattach the top clamp down plate to the drain body over the waterproofing membrane using bolts and tighten. Screw threaded nipple into clamp down drain to desired height. Spread a thin layer of mortar along the dimensions where the assembled channel is to be set. Apply a bead of silicone caulk around the outlet of the assembled channel. Set the channel into the threaded nipple and mortar. Ensure the channel is completely level. Spread a final mortar bed across the shower area. This mortar bed should be built up to be flush with the flange of the channel and sloped in one direction towards the linear drain. Ensure the weep holes of the clamp down drain do not become clogged. Install the backer board layer on all shower walls. Standard installation will result in a strip of material between the finished wall and the linear drain. For flush against the wall installation, a double layer of backer board should be used. Apply a liquid or fabric membrane to the channel's flange and shower area, as per manufacturer's instructions. Protect the inside of the channel to avoid waterproofing from being applied to these inside areas. Lay thinset and tile to the inside edge of the channel's flange. Do not allow the tile to finish past the inside edge. After flood testing the shower area as per local code, place the CI25 channel insert into the channel away from the wall. Spread a layer of thinset into the channel insert and floor. Then lay finishing tile up to the edge of the channel insert. We offer a broad selection of decorative choices and installation options that are proudly fabricated in Long Island, New York.